EKU men's basketball took the floor at McBray Arena last night as the Colonels welcomed in the Eagles of Midway University. Coach Hamilton and company coming off that big comeback win against UT Chattanooga were hosting a three-party early that was organized by Nick Mayo and Tay Weaver. Mayo buries this one from the top of the key to cap a 12-0 run. Mayo sharing the wealth, drops it off to Weaver, and he knocks it down as EKU hit their first four long balls. Kelvin Robinson on the dribble, takes it into the paint, and puts it up, and gets a shooter's bounce to put Eastern up 16. Midway would then go on a 12-3 run to cut the Colonel lead to 7. Nick Mayo left wide open, and you just can't do that. Eastern back up double digits. The senior finishes with 18 points and 9 rebounds. Colonel's pushing the pace. Robinson feeds Lachlan Anderson, and he brings the thunder from down under. That would just be the beginning for the Aussie. Kelvin Robinson drops a dollar's worth of dimes in this game. This one off the inbound as Anderson gets it to fall. The junior would lead the charge in this game as he had a career night. Anderson went 7 of 12 from the field, 8 of 9 from the stripe, as he logged 22 points and grabbed 14 rebounds for his first career double-double, leading Eastern Kentucky to the 107-52 victory. Peyton Broughton, Jordan Oakley, and Jamaru Brown all notched double-digit point totals, helping EKU cross the century mark for the first time since 2015. So the Colonels are on their way to the U.S. Virgin Islands, where they will play Kansas State to start the 2018 Paradise Jam. I'm David Miller for EKU Sports.